John from George is recognized for two minutes. I thank the gentleman for yielding. Mr. Speaker, I rise in support of this conference agreement. The Milcon VA section of the conference agreement includes a discretionary total of $71.7 billion, a decrease of $1.4 billion below last year's level, and a decrease of $2.1 billion before the President's request. For military construction, uh, the conference agreement provides $13.1 billion for military construction projects, and reductions to the budget requests are possible because of savings on projects that were appropriated in previous years. However, with, even with these reductions, the agreement funds family housing construction at $1.7 billion, which provides for a total of 48 new family housing units, 80 replacement units, and improvements to 216 family housing units. For Veterans Affairs, the conference agreement provides a total of $122.2 billion for the FY12 programs for the Department of Veterans Affairs of which $58.5 billion is discretionary funding. The agreement also contains $52.5 billion in advance funding uh, for the VA, the identical level that was requested by the President for our VA medical accounts. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I'm also pleased that the conference agreement uh, provides $45.8 million for Arlington National Cemetery, which is $700,000 over last year's level. Finally, Mr. Speaker, the conference agreement fully funds the Armed Forces Retirement Home request and includes $14.6 million for the Armed Forces Retirement Home to facilitate the repairs at the D.C. campus uh, to repair damage sustained by the earthquake in August. Uh, Mr. Speaker, let me just thank the committee and the subcommittee staff for all of their hard work in pulling the bill together on a bipartisan, bicameral, cooperative way, uh, taking leadership from our chairman and our ranking member uh, who have worked tirelessly to get this appropriations process back, back to regular order. Uh, I urge the adoption of the uh, conference report, and I urge all my colleagues to support it. It's a good bill.